Hello, I'm Gunnar Siasen. I have cystic fibrosis and a feeding tube. Thank you for watching the first episode of the Own Your Feeding Tube video series. This video was made possible by an unrestricted educational grant by Nestle Health Science, the Boomer Siasen Foundation. This video, the first day home with a feeding tube, will show how easy it is to use a brand new feeding tube. I will also demonstrate how to use the new NFIT transitional system to connect a pump set to a feeding tube, but more about that in a minute. Nothing within the Own It video series should be considered medical advice. Such advice can only be given by a physician who is experienced with cystic fibrosis. The Boomer Esiason Foundation, Gunner, and contributors to the Own It video series cannot be held responsible for any damage, which may result from using the information on this video without permission of your medical doctor. First, we will cover bolus feed. Bolus feeding is a quick, easy way to get calories during any time of the day without the need for a pump. Before starting, you will need the following supplies formula, a syringe, extension set, and water. Keep in mind that everything should be at room temperature. Start by washing your hands. Sit down. Connect the tubing and syringe to your button. Unclamp the extension set. Pour or draw room temperature water into the syringe and flush. Shake the formula well, then pour directly into the syringe and let gravity do the work. As a side note, it may also be easier to first pour the formula into a measuring cup with a spout before pouring into the syringe to prevent spills. You can change the angle at which you hold the syringe to increase or decrease the flow. Once you have completed the formula, flush with water, then clamp the extension set, disconnect, and close the button. You may wash your feeding tube supplies with warm water and soap after use. Next, I will show you how to tube feed with an Enterolite Infinity Pump. Personally, I use the pump for nocturnal feeds, but this can also be done during the day. This process is now a little different because of the NFIT connector system. Before starting, you will need the following supplies. Formula, a syringe, extension set, the pump set with pre-attached white NFIT Christmas tree connector, water, formula container, and the Enterolite Infinity Pump. Start by washing your hands. Shake the formula well, then pour the desired amount into the hanging bag and close cap. Connect the container to the pump. Connect the tubing and syringe to your button. Unclamp the extension set. Pour room temperature water into the syringe and flush. Turn the Enterolite Infinity Pump on and select the desired flow rate. Before connecting the pump set to the extender set, make sure that the white Christmas tree is securely connected to the NFIT connector by twisting clockwise until tight. Prime the line. Insert the Christmas tree into the extension set and twist clockwise until tight. You may now begin the feed. Once complete, disconnect the pump. Use a syringe to flush the extension set with water. Clamp the extension set, disconnect and close the button. The NFIT connector system is designed to improve patient safety by reducing the risk of misconnections. For more info on the NFIT connector system and its availability in 2016, visit infinityfeedingpump.com or stayconnected2014.org. Thank you for watching Gunnar Esiason's Own Your Feeding Tube video series presented by Nestle Health Science and the Boomer Esiason Foundation. We hope this demonstration has been helpful and fun. Got questions for Gunnar? Send them to us. If you're on Facebook, you can send them to us at facebook.com slash Boomer Esiason Foundation. You can Twitter us at twitter.com slash cystic fibrosis or twitter.com slash G17 Esiason. And you can also send an email to Gunner at gunnersblog at esiason.org. When Gunner answers your question, we'll credit you. So get busy and send them in.